Famous AI investor Kai Fu Lee said, GPT-5 training hasn't gone smoothly and warned that early predictions of AGI within three years might be too optimistic. GPT-5 was supposed to land by late 2024, but Lee said mid-2025 was more realistic. Sam's recent tweet confirmed we'll have to wait a few more months and it could get pushed back again. If Sam's tweet is any clue, OpenAI sees GPT-5 not just as a simple upgrade, but as a complete shift. That phrase, magic unified intelligence, suggests one model to do it all instead of the patchwork approach we've had. To understand why this is such a leap, look at what came right before it. GPT-4.5 launched in late February 2025, and it's massive. OpenAI's biggest model yet, soaking up more compute and data than any earlier release. It's the pinnacle of the classic GPT scaling strategy. More neurons, more data, more of everything. And sure enough, GPT 4.5's huge size delivers some perks. OpenAI says it has deeper world knowledge and a higher emotional IQ than GPT 4.0, but GPT 4.5 also showed the limits of brute force expansion. On a bunch of reasoning heavy tests, this giant still lost out to smaller AI models built for step-by-step -step thinking, including some from Anthropic and even OpenAI's own O series. In tougher math, or logic puzzles just being bigger isn't enough. Careful reasoning wins. OpenAI's own tests hint that GPT 4.5's gains from piling on data and compute are starting to level off. GPT-5 is OpenAI's big solution to these ongoing challenges. Instead of dumping another half billion dollars into making the model bigger for minimal improvements, GPT-5 blends the best of both worlds. The huge knowledge base from the GPT-4 line and the focused step-by-step -step reasoning of the O series. This step-by-step -step thinking is often called chain of thought reasoning. It's like the AI scribbles its own notes in the background before handing you the answer. 